Hello everybody, welcome back to Filament. Last time we took on some of the puzzles that perplexed us back at the beginning of the game and then learned about the corrupted files that there are to be found around the station. I still have no clues or ideas on what an arrangement for this is going to look like in time. We've seen this symbol before, but doing them in a straight line is certainly not it. So I'm going to have to leave that behind. It's probably end game stuff, I imagine. Now, this was the next thing on our to do. But it's very tricky. We have that great big long section at the top, which I think is going to need to be. But it could be approached from the left or the right. This here is just very much in the way. And that can't cut there because I can't come to the left and I can't go over the top. So what if we try... Coming across? But there's no way for me to get tension on this without coming from further below and hooking across. So, really not sure on that one. What if we try something starting more to the left-hand side, see how we go from there. Because I can't move that down. So I feel like that's going to have to be something that I more so finish on. Yeah, it's these last two in the top right corner that seem to have the least flexibility about them. Well, I can certainly... Well, if I do this instead, though, I don't have any way to get over to that right-hand side anymore because I've cut myself off. Which is what I was leaving myself by coming across the bottom instead. Those two aren't par or are parallel with one another, so a diagonal line can't hit them both. You can come all the way to the left. There's no way. Uh, maybe there is a way this works out. As unlikely as it seems. Although... Oh, that does work. So can I hit those other three, those other two, on the way down? Perhaps like this? Ah, oh, no. I've lost my angle on that. Ah, damn. And that doesn't allow for that there. And here I thought I had it. So... Approaching these end pieces from the right does work. So, how else can I do these ones at the beginning? Could I, in fact, just start with this and then do everything I just did? 
I think I can. I just have to remember exactly what it is I did to get there. I think this is good. Yeah. Nice. A big long cut through the middle. Slightly unexpected, but we got it. Oh, good grief. Right, the door's in the bottom left corner. So it's going to be a long walk up and back again, but probably not in such simple terms. I'm guessing I need to start on the right, because if I start with this, however this might go, I don't know that I'm going to be able to get back to the left-hand side. Seems very suspicious. This feels so suspicious. Um, how else am I going to get tension off of that? And the point I was getting to, though, was if I can't come through here, I can't now be on the left-hand side of the line that I've just drawn to get out, which is the big problem. So, what about starting on the right-hand side? That does go all the way up to there. And this will work. Oh, no, it won't. That's cruel. Oh, can I do the left-hand side of this? That keeps me away from that black wall, yeah. So, it's this with those two extra on the right-hand side somehow. But as a, a start, this looks reasonably sensible. I think... Yeah, this is not a possibility, because how do we ever then get back to this one? How do I do a full turn? Is it going to be kind of like a spiral that comes in on itself, then out on itself again? Perhaps? Like, maybe let's just try the most absurdly shaped thing I can imagine. See where that gets me. Not super far, must be said. Although, it does feel like it could be close. If I could get out to the left-hand side again, I just have to hook under that bottom left one as I exit, and that's not a problem. But I clearly can't go around this corner. So where can I go? Like the geometry has presented lots of bits that look right, it's just threading the last couple of things together. Evidently. I cannot get through there. It's 
so that's a bust. What logic can I use? Is always a reasonably good question. It's going to come down to probably starting here or ending here. And I think this looks more like an ending than a beginning. And I like how this thread goes so perfectly around so much of that. And hypothetically, I could do a lot of this backwards. It's just getting those last two. I can do that and that, and I probably was just here or somewhere very similar to it, wasn't I? I missed that bottom right corner. I don't have anywhere to go from here. It's just so continually not quite right. And once again, I wish I could draw on the ground of the level to little pieces that I'm convinced are correct so that I can thread them all together. That's unlikely, because how do I get to this pair again? But the fact that the line works out for that in such close, tight quarters almost feels, like, suspicious. Can't be this. So it's only this or this as a start. And the outside edge seems more likely. If I can walk back through this gap, I can't. So no point in trying to build up a solution using that so right hand side further takes precedent or priority and then there's no way for me to get tension around this piece in this manner. Apart from this, which can't be. So how can I ever get tension on that? That isn't this because this block gets excluded with that. It's a very perplexing puzzle. Is there ever a world where I can just kind of go up and back down in its entirety? That doesn't work, so I'd have to come in from the other side. That doesn't work, and now I've missed this. 
So I'm more and more convinced that the right-hand side is the correct side to start on. I don't think this works. Correct. So I go over this. That doesn't work. That doesn't work. And if I go any further along, I'm almost certainly, although maybe not, locking myself out of some other part of the puzzle I want. How did I get tension on the other side of this? I want to wrap over this side. Doesn't work that way. To come down to here. There's something here? I think I might need to re-navigate this situation. But this too doesn't let me get to that top bit the way I want to. I need a way out of what I've built. I feel like this top left corner is the bit that's letting me down currently. Oh. Oh. Hello. Is this what I needed? Is this going to work when I get to the bottom? Yes. Alright, we deduced a few things along the way. Pretty tricky, but we got it. Oh, good. Exits in the bottom right. Looks like we have to do a long loop of the top right edge to get that corner piece. And then it's going to be a case of looking for these many and varied routes that don't break things. Like, that breaks something. This breaks something. That breaks something, but I imagine I could go to the left here if it were available, so perhaps do it that way. I've probably missed something, but you never know. Oh, I definitely have. However, however. Oh, what luck. <laughs> All right, I can't complain. We did do that big long loop around the top right-hand side. Maybe they get simpler when there's more components because there's fewer things that actually work. Like there's fewer red herrings to trap yourself into. Now this, I think I need to come from down and hook around and up in one fashion or the other. Interesting that that doesn't catch that black one. Seems very unlikely, but indeed it doesn't. I bet I can't squeeze back through there, indeed. That doesn't catch and I'm not gonna be able to touch this one otherwise. 
maybe this. So this is what I was alluding to at the very start. Okay, that does hit that corner though. And that doesn't, which is very awkward. So I think that has to come from, or has to finish its loop in that manner. But if I do it this way, it doesn't touch. Whereas I think it did touch the previous way, didn't it? No, it didn't. Interesting. So that lower right one looks to be very particular about how it wants to be touched. Aren't we all? While I can go through there, uncertain about it. Alright, we're going to reset and just start getting some ideas about where we might start on the right-hand side of the puzzle. Though, not there. And as such, that leaves a lot to be desired, because there are very few other ways into this puzzle, it seems. That's not one. This isn't one. I don't think this is one, because how am I ever going to hit that bottom right pin that way? So that leaves these three on the left being our starting move. Nowhere to go with that, so perhaps it's a full loop like that, and I've missed this one. Also, like the whole bottom right corner, but we don't talk about that bit. I'm just trying to work with things that I can do. And so far, there's quite a lot working for us here. Well, I wonder if, for a start... Oh, I can't go through there. Okay, well, that loses out on that. If I do this, I can never get back to this and get out. If I do all of this stuff... Even if we come around... Yeah, well, for a start, that cuts me off. But then also, I don't know where I'm going to go once I've collected this lower right one. Right, I'm just going to switch to controller. Okay. Now, that one. So, I think I am starting on the left. I feel like I want to leave that very bottom left pin alone to kind of be my very last thing I do. Although, I think it's ever so slightly further out. So this way it doesn't hit that black one, which doesn't make any sense to me, really. And now it has hit it. That's very bizarre. That this doesn't hit it. How did I do that? Not sure, but I feel like this perhaps isn't the intended solution there. But if I can't squeeze through there, that's almost certainly not it as well. So what's left is the very awkward question. I'm really not sure how I'm going to get this and this.
the fact that those two can't be in line with one another when there's that black piece of the stone is a little frustrating. Especially when that doesn't touch. The three on the outside edge I can use whenever my heart desires. This I can do that to get those in the center if I want to. So it becomes these two on this wall that are my biggest problem. I don't know how I'm ever going to get the top one and the bottom one without breaking it in the middle. This is almost certainly what I just did. I also can't cut that corner at the end, which is its own problem. If I then do something like this, I've locked off these two within that chamber. Just really not sure what I can possibly do differently on this right hand side. To get the stuff I want. This can't work. Oh, it can. But I've missed this for a start. And I've trapped that. And I can't get this. I cannot see how to get that lower right one at all. And I certainly don't think I can start here. Can't start there. Can't start here. So, one of these three on the left has to be where we begin. Hmm. That looks more plausible. If I had instead Hold on, hold on. What did I just do that looked so good? Some version of this. Okay. This looks very good. I just need to figure out how to get that one vertical there. Where can I do an extra bit of chicane? I think... God, there's so much back and forth here. I think... I've lost it. Damn. Can't be this. Oh, that's so frustrating. Just that one guy, wasn't it?
This is going to be a different guy. It's both guys. How did I do those a second ago? How did I do those a second ago? I'm so mad that I can't picture the rest of what I did in this lower right-hand corner, the previous method, a second ago. Was it this? There or thereabouts? Looks like it was this, wasn't it? I want a button for, like, take a safe state. Have a memory of this. Okay, that was that. Some way to get around that center pillar. It's not this. There's something here. There must be. So close. So we go up and round and down for this. I don't think this is going to be it. Because I now can't squeeze in here. <sighs> I don't even know why I thought my brain would be tempted by thinking that was going to be a step towards success. No, I've, I've not got it. And by that stage, I'm not going to get it anytime soon. This is a shame. I thought we were doing really well. I do this without using that pin? I guess I could use this pin. Except now I can't go through there again. I can't come up to get to that pin. can get to it, but it's not available for lapping. So I need to figure out a way to go all the way around there to do this. This is probably what I just did. And then on the way out, we can chicane. Yeah. And I'm still missing that one. How can I just add in one extra turn? Because it's completely enclosed there.
can't be this because that doesn't let me use the pin. It's not going to be that because then I can't navigate around this piece being so close to it. No idea if this is making kind of a hypothetical difference for having that one in the top left available for use for something else. But it's just not going to go, is it? Even when I do this... But the fact that I can do it slightly differently with that top left corner suggests I was perhaps not using this correctly. I just don't know where I can put an extra lap in. And I hate it. Because it can't be this. It simply cannot be this. Alright. Gonna have to come back to that one another day. I think we've spent long enough postulating over that. Is there anything else on this ground floor? There is. There was the... Um, the logic gates puzzles down in the lower right corner, down there. Interesting that that one's yellow rather than all the other ones that are white and green, right? Then this is all done. These are done. These are done. And then this is a ladder upstairs. That's done. And the crew quarters. There must be loads of extra hidden stuff around here. For like visual secrets and stuff, no? Oh. Get every eighth cup of coffee on the house. Towel the firmament's best coffee. Okay, well... It's a collectible I didn't have before, so... Oh, what was that? Missed it. A bit under the weather, but otherwise... It... Good, thanks. You? Uh, nothing serious, just cold, I think. You know I will. Stuff for the fireplace. I'm excited to get started on it. Yeah, he's been going to help with the hologram side of things. Of course, I'll show you. Okay, that's a letter on the ground that I cannot collect. Not seeing any additional puzzles. Fish. The effective greenhouse. Giant picture book. Don't see any hidden patterns in the art. Found key card. That's the console cartridge. There's going to be like one key card tucked away somewhere. This, I wonder if it's an answer to one of those big wide room puzzles, you know? The big circular ones. But currently an unknown, and I can't take it with me. And 
did that one. No, I don't need this. Done that. We found the card that was on the floor of the stalls. Stalls, not stools. Captain poster. Lockers. Do you reckon there's like a, a thing where if you zoom out and look at the floor plan of the building, you could find, like, look at the bottom of the pool there. Tiles in the bottom of the pool are definitely a secret. This is a secret, but I'm mad that I can't solve it in the game. I feel like I'm going to have to copy this out to a sliding puzzle and then figure out its correct solution in order to find the secret that it's attached to, which is just so much work. And don't get me wrong, I appreciate the puzzle, but it's... The puzzle isn't in the game. I have to go out of my device to do it. I don't know. Can I play basketball? I can keep the basketball around. That's hilarious. All of this stuff, and they're like, yeah, here's a physics object. I feel like I missed a lot of this gym. I've not made it up to whatever that puzzle is yet. Have I seen the start of those puzzles? Yeah. It's just across the gym. And then some kind of rec room. That's just another of many terminals. It was me that put the request in for these old machines. They take me back to being a teenager. I get so wrapped up in the nostalgia of it all. I used to bike down to the arcade after school most days. There was this one kid who went by Red. She held the high score in practically every machine in there. Greedy, I know. I set out to beat her at my favorites. Spent a lot of time in pocket change trying to. Never managed it, though. For some reason, it really stuck with me. I figured that with all the spare time I would have out here, I could take another shot at getting those scores, get some closure on that front. Well, it took a few weeks, but I finally came out on top. It felt amazing. Then Aubergine walked in the next day and bumped me back to second, which did not. All right, I've spent enough time clicking on every surface looking for stuff. I don't even remember this library or the puzzles here contained within. It's got to be secrets in a library. There's an ID card. Nothing if I try and use the guitar. Fair enough. Yeah, I feel like I've not seen this whole section. Which is kind of impressive. Another key? Book? There's a lot of these books that... I don't know if they have... something about them that I'm missing. Arnold and a code one two three four five six seven eight I think I can unpick that code but again stories for another day all right that is definitely enough I'll do these next time because I haven't seen these before but for now thank you so much for watching I'll see you in the next one cheers